tonight I'm plating up some tiny little dinners for my mice. They're little gourmet dinners made up of couscous, some flaked almonds, and then also some pumpkin, all of which have really good health benefits for mice. I'm also going to be giving a larger dish of this to my rats. First in is Badger, let's see what she takes, the almond. They always seem to go for the almonds first, they absolutely love them. Then I find the pumpkin goes, and then the last thing that goes tends to be the couscous. Variety is really important in any animal's diet, and I find that my mice do tend to prefer the cooked types of vegetables, cooked grains, things like that. I do find that non-cooked grains and non-cooked pasta and things are really good for them as well because it helps to keep their teeth short, but in general they seem to prefer the flavour of things that are cooked. My rats tend to be a little bit in between, but I would still say there are some things they definitely prefer cooked, like carrots and things like that. But I do like to give them raw carrots and things again to keep their teeth short, raw pasta, things like that. I've actually been following the, I think you pronounce it, the Shunamite diet recently and trying to make up my own rat and mice foods. If that's something you'd be interested in learning more about, then I will look to make a video on that at some point, but I'm still kind of in the trialing phase at the moment. My Spinifex hopping mice, they do not really like cooked food. They're definitely more on the wild side. They like things to be how they would find them in the wild. So this is just some courgette for them. Again, lots of health benefits. They love capsicum. This is just raw capsicum. So I tend to keep their vegetables and their fruits raw, their nuts, their seeds, all of that uh, raw. The only things I'll give to them that are not raw is obviously anything like fish or meat. If I give them salmon or maybe a bit of chicken or even a bit of steak, something like that, then I'll give that to them cooked. It is really important for me to note that the things that I give them like this are supplementary to their everyday diet. So their everyday diet is the mix of the kind of lab blocks and seeds and grains and all of those important minerals and nutrients that they need. That comes in the form of their dry food. This fresh food is definitely just supplementary. So I would never advise to only give them this because they need a really balanced diet.